Hi everyone, today's NCC video demo is going to be talking about streams and DVR hours. So on NCC video, as you've been learning, this is all app based. Um, if you've watched other demos, you've learned that you have the ability to use this app on multiple devices, um, not just your traditional TV, um, which allows you to stream content whenever you want, wherever you want. And so um, in order to do that, you have to have something called a stream in order to watch the TV or watch the platform of, of product that we sell. So when you subscribe to this or you switch over to NCC video, uh, we're gonna have that conversation with you. How many streams do you think you need? So with traditional TV, we are used to the fact that you have to have a set top box on every single TV, right? So that goes away. And now you just need to decide how many streams works for you and your family. So you no longer have to think of it as a stream per device or a stream per TV. A stream rather refers to an active streaming of a channel. So at any given point, how many people at one time might be streaming or using the product, watching TV on any given device um, in the home or between your home and the farm or between your home and your lake cabin, etc. So you can get up to a maximum of six streams with NCC video um, per package that you purchase. So that's the new way of thinking about this. So if you have just a couple of people in your home, you maybe don't need to have six streams going at one time unless each of you literally is going to be watching three devices at one time. So that is something um, that really separates um, NCC video from the traditional TV product is streams and how we use them. So if you have decided on the amount of streams that works for your family and then all of a sudden another user comes in um, and you've given them your login credentials and they're going to download the app and start watching NCC video on their device and they are going to be the third person. Let's say you pay for two streams today and they're number three. When they try to jump on, they can as long as the other two people are not also using it. So if you and your spouse are both streaming and CC video at the same time, and that third person tries to jump on and also stream with your information, they're gonna get a notification saying, please contact the office, you are out of streams. You've used the maximum number allotted. So at that point, they know that they don't have the capability to watch right now because other people and other devices are currently actively streaming, so it's not allowing them to do it. Next, we're gonna go ahead and jump into the DVR hours. So I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the app and step off to the side and show you how the DVR hours work. So again, in past demos, we've talked about DVR hours and where to find your recordings. Um, we touched a little bit on the icon up in the top right corner, which allows you to see how many hours you have used compared to what you have purchased. So here you can see that I've used 8.1 hours of my 300 hours that I pay for. And so at this point, I know that I have space to continue to record. But as I continue to record more and more shows, that space is going to uh, decrease. I'm gonna get closer and closer to my 300 hours. So that's a quick way to come out and see hours. Again, um, as I mentioned before, when you sign up for NCC video or switch over, we're gonna talk about that. We're going to say, how many hours do you think you need? And so that's kind of tough because we're used to a set top box and we may or may not know how much time that set top box even allows us to um, have for storage of shows. So you can start off small and you can watch how fast you're filling that up by simply viewing um, this bar at any time, which will let you see where it is. Now the nice part is as you get closer to using your um, amount of hours that you've purchased, you may have the ability to go up. 
So 300 hours is the most um, hours that you can purchase. So that is the highest purchase point for storage space that you can get. Um, but you can go as low as five hours or 50 hours and you can move up as needed. Uh, what I'm gonna jump into next is we've talked a little bit about streams and DVR space and how you may at any time need to increase the amount of streams or increase your DVR hours. So obviously you can call into the office at any time and we'd be happy to increase those for you or decrease them. If you've purchased way too much and you're not even getting close to that, you can always decrease it. Another option that you have that we're really excited about is at any time you can go out to our website and log into your Smart Hub account or create a Smart Hub account, and you have the ability to log into your services and make changes. So if it's after hours or on a weekend and you have somebody using your NCC video credentials and they're getting that error message saying there's not enough streams and, and, it, and you know that they need to be able to access it, everybody else is using the allotted streams already, you can log into your Smart Hub account and you can send a service order out to increase your streams right then and there. Same goes for DVR hours. It's the weekend, you're ready to sit down and binge watch all of your DVR recordings, but you have something set to record that night. When you sit down, you realize you're already at your max amount of hours, so you need to either start deleting something or you have to choose to not record what's going to be on. You no longer have to make that decision. Again, you can go to our website, log into your Smart Hub account, or create a Smart Hub account, which would then give you access to your services, and you can increase your DVR hours right then and there. So those are some really exciting things that we um, are so pleased and so excited to offer our members, um, giving you the ability to control your services, put it at your fingertips, and let you adjust how it works for you and your family. So that concludes today's demo, um, which is speaking about streams and DVR hours and how you can make changes to those two features at any time just by logging into your Smart Hub account or creating a Smart Hub account. Thank you.